Good morning and welcome to the 2016 Fun Dance Film Festival and what I believe is the 10th annual Mecca down the red carpet here in Love Hall. And leading off first is a wonderful group from the classroom of the BSBs. We have a wonderful tie here and some shades. How are you doing today, sir? Great. How are you? Excellent. What's y'all's film? Um, it's our film is Hand in Hand. Hand in Hand. And tell me a little bit about Hand in Hand. Um, it's this program that helps Chinese kids learn about their culture. Chinese kids learning about the culture. And were you the screenwriter, sir? Yes. You were. How did you come up with the idea? Well, my sister was one of the <coughs> first original members of this, well, organization to help kids learn about their culture. Awesome, awesome. Sounds like a wonderful film. Y'all have a wonderful day right down the carpet. Now, oh, solid suit. Nice second batter here. Got to talk to the man in the gray here. Tell, what's your name, young man? Esfandaya. Esfandaya. And what's your film, Esfandaya? The title is Refugees. Refugees. And what's Refugees about, buddy? It's about a film where people, well, refugees are people running from other countries to be safe, and that's been mainly what our uh, movie's about. Excellent, excellent. And looking, dashing, tell me where your dress is from today. Uh, Michael Kors. Michael Kors, beautiful. Right this way down the red carpet. Right this way. Ladies, ladies, come right over here. We have our first all-girls group. The camera here is a seat. There it is, the camera right there. Look up. And our first ensemble here. Tell me a little bit about your film, ma'am. What is it? film is Make a Change, and its theme is Synergy. Synergy. Tell me a little bit about Synergy. Uh, well, our thing is to tell people how to adopt and um, how to adopt pets and how they need your help. And I got to know, how do we get the girl power group here? Five girls. This is a lot of Synergy, a lot of energy. Um, well, we just came back from PE one day, and they had the group, like, on a slideshow, and then it was just all girls, so that's how we got our group. PE energy to synergy, right this way, ladies. <laughs> all righty, folks, who we got next? We got some more shades. We got a great look in the back. Three guys, two girls, guys leading the way. You look pretty serious. Smile. Come over here. Look over here at the cameras right here. Turn right here. Cameras right here. All right, tell me a little bit about your film. Well, our film was about a 17-year-old, 16-year-old that uh, he was playing lacrosse one day, and his neck, like, he collided with a player, and his neck just, like, like cracked, you could say, or just, like, like yeah, and he was paralyzed, and our story was about that. Wow, lacrosse players here in the group? Play lacrosse? Okay. Y'all like lacrosse? How'd you pick your bow tie this morning, man? Uh, I just picked it out of the closet. You just picked it out of the closet. It's right in there in the closet. And what about these dresses, ladies? They're outstanding. Where are they, where are they from? Uh, the mall right there. The mall. Excellent. Right on down the carpet, ladies. Howdy, folks. How we doing? Oh, my goodness. Check you out. Camera's right here, folks. Look, look right here. All right. Tell me a little bit about your film. Um, it's about whales, saving the whales, because they're starting to go extinct because of all of the pollution and the whales are just saving them from the Who is the screenwriter for the film? Uh, ah, you look like a screenwriter. Can you tell me who you are? Um, I was just thinking about, like, animals that were getting, like, abused, and whales just popped into my mind, and I just thought that that was a good thing to do. Musical choices for the film? Who 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 did the sound? Ah, you did the sound. We used Underwater. It's a song by Mika, and uh, uh, the song we used was by Mika, uh, and we had the, and we had the original sound for, we had the original music from the iMovie, for the iMovie. Excellent. Stunning group. Go enjoy your day. Excellent film about whales. Howdy, folks. How are we doing this morning? 
camera's right here. I know. They, they need to see the beautiful people like yourselves. Okay. All right. Tell me a little bit about your film. Um, well, our film is inspired by her grandfather, Ray Broadway, and um, it's an inspirational story about perseverance. Perseverance through what? what? Tell me about your granddad. Well, um, our story is kind of about, well, he wanted to grow up to become a famous football player, but um, when he was, as he was doing that in high school, he hurt his leg, so he, he got Osgood Slaughter's disease, and then he got tackled and he couldn't play football anymore, and but then he became a famous football coach. So. Football players here, gentlemen? Football player, a little bit. Who's the screenwriter? Ah, screenwriter about your dad. Who did the sound? Sound? Um, some of the adults might recognize this if they've seen the movie Forrest Gump. It's one of the soundtracks from that movie. Forrest Gump, excellent soundtrack. Right this way, enjoy your day. Whoop. Purple power coming at me. Here we go. I see a theme. I see a theme. Is the name of the movie Purple? No. What, what's the name of the movie? Uh, our movie is about Alzheimer's. And how, how do people with Alzheimer's get it? My grandmother has Alzheimer's, so we decided to do a story to like tell and get people to donate to the cure. Now, how did we, did we pick our outfits today? Was this a group thing, or did y'all just all end up here in purple? It was a, a group thing. Nice. Where did you get the glasses, guys? Oh, uh, we got it at Party City. Party City, great place to go. Right this way, enjoy your day. Down to Miss Sadler. Come on down, folks. How we doing? Camera's right over here. Okay, guys. Everybody out there wants to hear you, so you got to talk loud. Can you do it? Yes. All right. Tell me about your film. Um. So we're doing Malala Yousafzai, and. Whoa, 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 whoa! Rewind the tape. Malala Yousafzai. Yes. Okay. Tell me about your film. Um. Well, we just thought this was a great topic because we think that it's just terrible that women are being treated this way, and it's a great story about determination, and almost like I'm okay because she didn't. She didn't want violence. She just wanted peace for women. Excellent. Who's the screenwriter for the film? Oh, wow. And, and this folks, I'm getting a lot of screenwriters, but i got to talk to the outfits back here. Where'd your outfit come from today? Well, it, it came from um, Gav, I think. Closet? Yes. Oh, that's solid. And yours? Nice um, shawl, by the way. Thank you. It's my mom's vest, pretty much, and yes. Excellent. All right. Right down this way, folks. Enjoy. All right, we've got more shawls, more furs. Oh, we've got glitz and glamour here, ladies and gentlemen. All right, I got to go to glitz and glamour, Party City Shades, and what looks to be Marilyn Monroe. All right, tell me a little bit about your film. Uh, like it's really like just inspirational because we all like really helped out, and it's about um, well, Mary Campbell's cousin who always really stays happy even though he has cerebral palsy. Okay, your cousin. Did you write the film? Uh, yes, sir. I did write the film. Who did the sound? Uh, ah, Marilyn Monroe and Gene Kelly. Yes. And how did you get the? How did you get the song? Well, like my mom, she helped me a lot with it because she just like went on the website and she's just like, "Ooh, these would be good," and she like had a lot of picks, and I couldn't really choose from them. Excellent. My man here wins for casual look with the Hawaiian shirt. Give me some knocks. Well done. Y'all enjoy the day. Howdy. Well, hello, sir. We got a little musical jam going for the film, or is this just what you wanted to – is this what you're feeling? We have a football-related film? All right. Tell me about it. Okay, so it's called Touchdown for Hope. This is about Kate's grandfather. Um, from being in an orphanage to be something he always dreamed of and being something amazing. I would ask more questions, but I don't want to give the film away. But I got to know, how did you decide on the ensemble today? I, I, I just don't know. We just, yeah. just woke up feeling it. Just woke up feeling All right, okay. Ladies, you look great. Uh, I like the boots with the dress. Tell me, where did it come from? 
I don't specifically know, but I wore it to this dance. Excellent. Work with it. Work down the carpet. All right. We've got Uncle Sam and a jam and some hair. Oh, wow. This is a group. Folks, right over here. All right. Turn this way to the camera. Okay. Uncle Sam, um, what, what, what film do we have? On the Street. On the Street. Tell me a little bit about On the Street. Um, it is about homelessness and helping homeless, not just walking by them. All right. So not just walking by. Who is the screenwriter for the film? Um, well, I've written a lot of things about homelessness um, throughout this year, so I decided to um, try to write a script about it. And it's really important to me, so that's why I wanted to write it and do it. Excellent. Folks, y'all enjoy your day right down there to Miss Savage. Here we go. Some more lovely outfits. The jeans. Oh, wait, we got a little Tom Cruise look here. You, you have no idea what risky business is, but you're wearing it right now. Um, tell me a little bit about your film. Um, our film is about dyslexia and what dyslexics face in their everyday lives. Tell me about the reading. How, how, did, how did we come about this? What was the inspiration behind the film? So Cece, the screenwriter, is dyslexic. And before she went to Skank, she had a lot of troubles with dyslexia. So she wrote about it in her film. Writing about troubles helps you get through it. That's awesome. I'm, I'm inspired already. Gentlemen, did we just want to go with the blazer look and the shades to look cool? Just support them? All right. Well done. Well done. Right this way. Uh, thing one, two, three, four, and five. Back up this way. All right. Um, just the wigs part of the movie or just y'all's uni unification throughout the film? Tell me um, about it. So we wanted to, like, look like a team. And since part of our movie is about cancer, we wanted to, like, raise awareness for cancer with Pink. Awesome, awesome idea. Y'all look great. This is really cool. So um, what was the inspiration behind the film? Um, it's about – well, uh, inspiration was – Basically me. Well, basically me is a great thing to be. The wigs, I, I mean, the purple and the pink, outstanding. Y'all are y'all are great. Go enjoy the day. All righty, we've got gold, we've got green, we've got everything in between. All right, here we go. Pretty dress. All right. Got to go with the hat. You're the screenwriter, aren't you? The of course you are with the hat. Tell me a little bit about your film. So our film is about heart disease, and it's inspired on Andrew's grandpa. He he died when he was uh, like seven, and of a, of a heart attack. And yeah, that's how I made the film to be. I understand. I understand. My my dad passed away the same thing. So that's. That's close to me, near near and dear. Um, inspirational inspirational film. Great ensemble there uh, in the hat. And I got to know, where's the dress from? You look outstanding. Um, Michael Kors. Another Michael Kors. That designer's winning today. So right down the red carpet here. Howdy, folks. Come on down. Oh, we've got confident walks here. Confident walks. Excellent. How are we doing today, folks? Good. How are you? I am great. Tell me a little bit about your film. Um, so it is about cerebral palsy, and my brother and um, Dorsey's sister both have cerebral palsy, so that's why we made the movie about it. Who was the screenwriter? Yeah, there's two screenwriters. And the director? Ah, he's the director. And y'all did more than just look good, right? Okay, what was y'all's job? I was the cinematographer. Excellent. And I was the sound director. Um, well, we chose Ride by 21 Pilots because it really matched the story of um, cerebral palsy. Awesome. Enjoy the day, folks. Right down this way to Miss Sadler. Howdy, folks. Oh, we got our first soccer playing bow tie. Well, well done, young man. Well done. Excellent. Tell me a little bit about your film. Um, it's about abandoned and abused animals and 
it was just a cause dear to y'all's heart, or do we have an inspirational story behind why you choose the move? Yeah, so my dog was a um, kidney failure, and she just came in to do land threat rescue, and she wouldn't eat anything, and so that was my inspiration to write this story. Excellent, excellent. And we just go on with the soccer jersey because we felt like it, or soccer, hockey, and a bow tie, and well done. Well done. All right, enjoy, folks, right this way. And here come the elegant teachers to walk the red carpet. They're looking fabulous today. Ladies, how are we feeling? Awesome. How do, how do, we, like, how do we like our students' chances? I think they all stand a really great chance. We're so proud of all of their hard work. So creative. And what are we wearing today? This is a Diane Dalbo original from the uh, Love Hall collection. Wow, Dalbo lives on. It is an original. And she and, and you, Ms. Lee? Uh, this would be a Veronica Lee, my sister's closet. Wow. <laughs> familial, familial, my sister's closet. And this elegant red ensemble? This is a Stephanie Frame original. Wow. Look at the Love Hall teachers go. Right this way down the red carpet, ladies. Okay. Folks, thanks for being here at the 2016 Fun Dance Film Festival and for the future of film. Um, on a more serious note, I can remember one of the first films here was about a brother, a little brother of a student who had autism, and it really touched me. Uh, little did I know later I would have a daughter with autism um, who is the love of my life, and um, these films can really, really touch students, touch parents, um, and, and affect. So parents, folks, never underestimate the abilities of your children and enjoy them with all you have. Have a great day.